Howdy ho, buddies! Thanks for tuning in as we continue the adventures of Marek, son of Shchechin. This is the old knight halberd. It's way too heavy and we're not gonna use that and accidentally pressed emotes again. We're gonna go back to the maze because the maze wrecks face. And we are here in this place, I forgot what it's called. What is this place called? Oh my god, it doesn't even show me. And I forget. It's the... the wharf. Something about wharf. It's the Pirates of the Caribbean. <sighs> Jesus Christ. My name's Madame. I am an excellent let's player. Welcome to zombie mode. Ugh, I'm not even gonna turn human yet. Gosh darn, now we can't summon help. So, welcome to the wharf. The something something wharf. This is where I died, died because I fell off a fucking... This is a bridge, like a makeshift bridge. At least I got my souls. You tarred me, really? No, oh, welcome to the party. Surprise, it's your birthday, Marek. It actually is my birthday kind of soon. But today is not this day, foul pirate beasts. These are some kind of pirate men. I think they're half pirate, half viking, which makes them a dangerous combo. And barrels of stuff here. There's a guy out here, yes? Yes, he's a viking. Let's do battle. They throw tar at you, um, which I was gonna say doesn't seem that bad, but if you get hit by fire, your ass explodes. Uh, that becomes particularly annoying later. But even though I am undead, I am still a paladin, a master of the clergy, a son of Shchechin, and I can heal my wounds. Titanite shard, which is nice, which is nice. For upgrading our mace to plus 10 and then make murder happen. Okay, so we have the archer back there and Mr. Anger Viking here. Yes, you were not prepared for my blocking abilities. Huh? Huh? You wanna strike at me, fool? Death awaits you. Oh, oh, it pierced my lung. Oh my god, it hurts. This place is surrounded by water, some of which is traversable, some of which are instant death. You might have noticed that because you see a couple of minutes ago I died from it and it was fucking embarrassing. Um, what is this? Life gems and stuff. Nice. So as you can see I did not drown that time. Oh my god it's an ambush. Um, okay. You guys want to battle over here? One on one please. I said one on one, please. This is not going optimal. At least this guy doesn't have a, ch a shield, so. And you see, since I have a mace, his ass is stunned. We do have a bunch of life gems because we bought them from um, Malensha, or whatever her name was. Hello, how's the walking going? There's a weird creature hiding in there. I don't know if you can see it, YouTube, but it's horrendous. I do not like it. But I do have a torch with me. Why are you hiding in the darkness? Ah, it's scared of the light, and I am a paladin of the light, so you die now. Consider your soul cleansed. Nice, we got a high-ranking life gem. And some arrows. Which we might someday need. Someday. Shrine of Uhura? Azura? Shrine of Attila the Hun? There is a shrine later in the game. Um, I don't know the state of it now. But when this game was new. It was absolutely horrendous. It was horrendous because everything there had ranged attacks and if you didn't bummer dude 
All right, so here we have a battle versus shielded Viking, archer, and a dog. You see, the dog is rabid, but the dog does not block. So the dog, which causes uh, bleeding damage as well, should be priority number one. Let's pop that life gem. All right, drop an item, a soul. Oh, you're trying to freaking Taurus, bro. Now you are dead. That archer is pesky, and I want to get rid of him. There is a thing here I want to do, but I'm not going to do that when the archer's still around. Enjoying your dinner, boss. Enjoy, mace to the face. Oh, I didn't do a backstab execution. How about you? You want to get backstabbed? Oh, he did not at all want to be backstabbed. So let's just murder his ass. V v Varagian. So I assume these people are called Varagians. They will die, no matter what their name is. For they have opposed a paladin. Here's the bandit starting armor. And accompanying weapon. And I, I sense secrets. Oh, there's no secrets. Oh, I sense trap. I wasn't even in the stairs anymore, dude. You are the worst trapper ever. Here's a chest that I, for some reason, broke my first playthrough, so I didn't know what was in it. Repair powder and titanite chart, which is nice. I'm glad I didn't break it this time. Whoa. Down with you. Is the archer here? Or was that the archer? Ah, a locked door. Someday we'll open it for a shortcut. I'm gonna go ahead and assume that that guy we knocked down is the archer. Let's see if he is going back up. Archer man, hello. Die. Oh. That was an unnecessary strike against me. And I'm sorry, viewer, that you had to witness such incompetence. Here's an important part of this area. Oh, that wasn't even the archer. Of course it wasn't. Because he's down here. Oh, you can hear some creaking noise. That's the dark ones fearing the light. So, as you might understand, we, li we lit the huge torch up there. And now the dark ones that are hiding further up the level are in a terrified state. And that's good for us. Sorry, I had to bend over for a second. <laughs> you said bend over. What a faggot. Don't say that. That's hate. Come on. Let me backstab you for once. Aww. Your backstabbing radius is unnecessarily bad. Haha, <laughs> here it was. Shoo-hoo-ee! Ring of life protection. What does the life ring protection? Nullifies death, but breaks. You see, that means that when you die, you don't lose your souls and all that. Uh, but the ring breaks. But if I'm... I've never worn that for some reason because I'm not pro. Um, but it... Uh, you just pay some souls and it gets repaired and you have it back again. Oh no. Multiple Varagrians. Ver ver oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm not ready. Move, Marek, for the love of Jesus. This is bad. Okay, alternative strategy. Regroup. Attack from behind. Alright, the dog's down. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm not terribly happy that I had to use an Estus there, but it was a worst case scenario. It was a noob case scenario. Where are you going, dudes? You have no shield, so you die first. You see, that's how Dark Souls works. Ah! Stop making me look like a fool. I am Marek, and you are dead. I say that like he's always going to be dead, but if I use a bonfire, he'll just be alive again. He'll keep mocking me. Hello? Hello? 
impossible. Yes, it is impossible. Hmm. Hmm. Yes. Oh, and I just walked into Tar. That's genius. Hi, fool. How's death working out for ya? Alright, more treasures, more treasures. Am I missing something? Probably. Good for me. You see, I'm kind of in a state of hurry. Not really, but I really don't like this place and I don't want to stay here longer than necessary, both for your sake and my own. You see, this place is usually swarmed with the dark ones, but they're hiding in there now because there's a shadow there. So it's good that we lit the bonfire thingy. Ooh. You see, sometimes they get like so sick of being scared that they just ignore their fears and charge you. Then they're ultra relentless. They will attack you with such ferocity. It's not even funny. I am Thor. I am Thor. I am Thor. And you see, that 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 shit used to slaughter the dark ones. Now it took tr three, three bolts just to kill one. That's that's ridiculous. Oh. These guys are not so easily stunned. That life gem was unnecessarily used. Hello, excuse me. Oh my god, dark ones. Haha, <laughs> you can't reach me through the doorway because you are too large. The doorway is too small. Oh, you cannot reach me. Nah, 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 nah. Your mother was a hamster and your father smells of elderberries. Come at me, dude. Come at me. Oh my Jesus, Lord. I did not mean to offend your mother, nor your father. Oh, he's going into rage mode. But I am behind him. Ah, yes. Your animation stopped you from succeeding in battle. Whoa. Was not really paying attention. Come at me, bro. Come at me, dark one of the metro sewers. Arrgh! Fear me, for I am a god. Amongst men. Tee -hee. Oh. That was a trap. Allow me to backstab you. Their reach is perfect. However, their skulls still break when you smash them with a hammer. That is why I am Paladin. Oh my lord, how many are you? Were you just hiding around here, like, minding your own business? How's that working out for you? This is also a place that I missed uh, during my first playthrough. I did not dare face off against the dark ones. I was not ready to face so many of them in such a small quarter. Great sword, that's amazing. Trap! You see, when you open it, you hear that little creaking sound. You know shit's about to go down. Silver talisman, what did that do? Where's the silver talisman? Is that like a thing? Um, probably not important. Did I miss it? Because I'm currently not even looking. So let's let's think about that later. Who are you, strange man in dwarven armor? Who are you? I am Arik, son of Shashin! I, Gavlan. Greetings, Gavlan. Gavlan will, Gavlan deal. That doesn't even make any sense. Gavlan wants soul. Many, many souls. <laughs> yeah, me too. Nothing to get drunk over at all. You know, you get souls if you kill what like anything. You want? I want whatever you're selling, brah. With? Yes, he's just gonna talk forever. Uh, he is one of few guys you can sell items to. They're never gonna do that. Raises poise. The ring of giants. He also sells arrows and lots of poison stuff. You can apply poison to. Uh, your weapons, throwing knives, and reduces poison buildup and cures poison. Let's let's buy like five of those. They're expensive, but you know, YOLO, right? Um, the Ring of Giants, we can buy that later. Maybe yeah, whatever you say, my friend. Ah! Doors are for pussies. Let's move on. We do want to open the shortcut. 
to the boss before we attempt the boss. I think the shortcut is up here. Even though the shortcut doesn't help too much, it is a shortcut, so that's a good thing. Again, I take unnecessary amount, un unnecessarily amounters of damagers. Uh, speaking aside, that was bad. Oh, you tarred me, bro. You know you have a shield mark. How about you use that for once? Ugh. Look at me. Ugh, I'm all sticky and disgusting. Ah, this is this place. We have to do this anyway, so let's do that right away. This is what we're here for. Enjoy the magnificence. It's a boat. It's a ghost boat. And no, it doesn't have Jack Sparrow on it because... Because uh, that actor guy is doing other movies. And now it's telling us, heal up and go home. No, we will not heal up and go home just yet. We have a shortcut to open. Ah, and here's a building that we're gonna enter. Because it has, like, fire arrow in it. Oh, dark ones. Multiple dark ones. Simultaneously. I was gonna... That was a risky move. But now we're one versus one, which means good stuff. Darkness imprisoning you. What do you know? What do you see? That awaits you. And we get some upgraded life gems from him. That's good. That's good. So let's do this. Let's open the shortcut and get our ass home. And let's see if we dare uh, attempt the boss here. Or if we're going to go back and get some help. You see, I hate this boss. In its current stage, it's it's not too bad. But on New Game Plus, uh, it, you face off against this boss, which I fought, found very intimidating at first. Um, together with two dagger-throwing super ninjas. So I do not love him. And it is also one of the boss fights which you can... Uh, used to gain progress with Lucatil's quest. So what we're gonna do is uh, turn human and attempt the boss. Let's do that. Let's seriously do that. Do 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 yeah yeah. It's gonna be super exciting I promise. We're gonna learn stuff about ourselves. Huh. Dark ones, hello. Death awaits you and all that. Hi. Surrender your life. Give me your souls. Blah blah blah, you know the drill. Thank you. Was there a chest here or is it just this bucket here? It's just the bucket. We can get the bucket later if we want. Um, hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Whatever you have, we want it. Effigy and life gem, that is good. Here we have a viking trying to hide in the water. Oh, that is bad. Our mace is about to break as this super inconspicuous ambush is about to happen. So what we're gonna do is uh, remove these two and equip uh, this. And we're gonna uh, do that. And thus, our mace is repaired. Good thing we had that in hand, right? Good thing that item exists. Before we go to the boss, we're gonna talk to this guy. Exhaust his dialogue because we want him to go to Majula. Hmm. I see light, but it remains dim. I'm a paladin, I should shine, bro. I am Carillion. And I've no interest in the magic impaired. Oh, you're a sorcerer. I am a miracle user, a paladin, if you may. We have nothing in common. Hmm. I see light. I am... Okay, he doesn't want to talk to us because our intelligence is not high enough. You see, we are not smart people. 
we use faith instead of intelligence, which is kind of a mm, kind of bad thing to say. No, 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 Marek. You see, that water is the kind of water that kills you. You see, I would never get killed by simple water. Ha 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 ha! I am Marek, son of Chechen. Um, but it's the lock-on system can really screw you over there. Yeah, punch him through the shield, Marek, like a man. And eat the life gem. Okay, you see, I, I, I want to do the boss. Um, but I'm going to have to edit here. Because I've been drinking so much goddamn soft, I need to pee. I'll be right back. And welcome back, everyone. Uh, sorry for that human functions. You know, I'm sorry. It's a better than I know. And we're going to go up here. And we're going to clear out this both before we do anything else. I will murder you. Yes, the murder is complete. Ah. But a boat of this magnitude is rarely manned by one man alone. Ah, these guys can use Estus. They are true undead. Ugh. And their stunning abilities is actually quite impressive. I, I died. I Estus. I'm sorry. These guys are super annoying. Whew. Okay, get your head in the game, madame. You know this. You've done this before. Uh, charge forth. Death to our enemies. Foolish archer disrupting my honorable battles. Only death. That is all I will ever give to you. Okay, I've spent way, way, way many more Estuses than I am willing to admit. And the boss is right down here. So I'm actually gonna use a human effigy. And summon help. It is not a sign of weakness. It's not a sign of weakness to call for help. Uh, what we wanna do is here we have Spartan King. Where is Lucatiel? Okay, we want to get Lucatiel first. No, no, fuck that. We're gonna get Spartan King. He's a Spartan King, dudes. Oh, no. I waited too long. We also have Ignorable Poker. Let's go with that. Any help I can get. Uh, you can always summon two, so, uh, two phantoms to help you. Um, but the NPC takes up one of those slots. That is Lucatiel. <clears throat> so... Oh god, oh, oh yeah, it's all the way up here. I hope uh, Mr. Poker Joker does not take offense that I take time to go up here. Um, the problem with Luca Teal though is that she has during... Oh, he doesn't, he didn't want to help us. The problem with Luca Teal is that she had like a severe brain hemorrhage or something when she was younger. So there is a huge risk that she just walks into the deep end of the water and kills herself, which is very, very, very annoying. Um, so we have to babysit her and not go too far because it usually happens when you run off. Then she's like, oh, I'm going to walk straight line towards you and just walks into the water. So carefully now look at Teal of Mira. Look at Teal, daughter of Mira. That title I gave you, it's better. Let's hope there's another human player here because, as I said, Luca Teal is not the brightest. She's not too bad, but she is not so smart. Um, so I'm gonna wait here. Now I'm gonna look for a summoning sign near the boss door. No, because you can't put a summoning sign on the boat because it doesn't always exist. So I'm gonna cut here, wait until I find a human player to help me. Ah, the ignorable poker finally decides to show himself. I bow before you, ignorable poker. Glory to Astoska. I am the son of Szczecin. And let us battle together with Lucatil of Mira. You see, what we want, as I said, is for Lucatil to be alive at the end of the boss fight. Uh, if you're an achievement hunter, 
and Luca Teal dies, you should kill yourself. Let the boss die. But now we have Ignorable Poker with us. Um, and it may not, you know, be nice because he wants he wants to kill the boss. So what we're gonna do is make sure that Luca Teal is out of the heat, so to speak. We have not rested at a bonfire in between, so uh, so we don't have any spell uses. Come on, focus on me, focus on me. Luca Teal has one advantage. She can take the god of beatings. Like, she took some full blows from him, and it barely dented her health. Making this an easy fight. Thank you, ignorable poker. You were a great help, and without you, Lucatil might have died. Glory to Astoska. Bye. Wow, that was an awkwardly long goodbye. Thank you, Lucatil of Mira. So we now have plus one in her quest, which means we only need to kill two more bosses with her. And I think there are three more. I think there are a total of four bosses. Um, but there is one that I'm probably going to do the two remaining quest battles for. Because it's such an easy boss. And you get a good reward for doing it in New Game Plus as well. So so that's what. Now we can go up here and finish, finish the wharf. Uh, the first thing we get here is a pretty good item for those who needs it. It is technically in this game a paladin item because it has to do with faith it's actually pyromancy pyromancy also stacks with faith and we can also examine this weird contraption Yo ho, yo ho, and a pirate's life for me! Totally. And we're moving out. This is an, a very slow cutscene. Good for you. And it goes off to a loading screen. Yes, my cat does not like long loading screens, doesn't he? Sorry. Pay attention on the viewers, Marek. Um, and here we are. What is this place? I can tell you what this place is, but I'd rather just show you. Do, 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 do. I don't. Th When's the title card for the area coming? Probably never. Okay, what does this say? Message. Yes, it is a message. Hurrah for rolling, yes. Alright. <gasps> I'm in a cage. An elevator cage. Let's hope the title card comes up, because we have to... Oh, did you see? That was items. Anyway. Ugh, oh, the excitement is killing you, right? Oh, here my button presses of excitement. There we go. Door opening. Uh, loot, please. Loot, please. Hello, my name is Marek. I am looking for the loot. No loot. So let's go up here. Aha! It's the Lost Bastille again. You see this? This is the back door, so to speak. Um, you can progress from the other way and you'll end up here and vice versa. So let's light the bonfire. This was a special kind of episode and I thank you for watching through it. And uh, I will see you in part 10 of the adventures and exploits of Marek, son of Chechen. Fare thee well.